This is FNet News with Jason Brown. Bringing you the latest and greatest from Ellis Free Network. <laughs> FNet News Podcast. This is ENN, the Penis Pump Broadcasting Company. Hello, everybody. Welcome to another episode of FNet News. Ha <laughs> ha I'm Jason Motherfucking Bandy, and this is episode uh, 138, I think. High energy as fuck salute. Big shout out to all of you for listening to my music on Spotify and Google and all of that shit. Angie's been listening because every time she sends a snap to the snap group, it's playing in the background. So that's cool as fuck. And if you like Snapchat and you use it, make sure to add me. I'm Smiggy999. Rest in peace to Dick. That's a reference to him. <clears throat> shout out to Jira, by the way, who sent me 20 bucks uh, for my collection of music, which I have put up on all the platforms because I'm technologically savvy. Um, the only other people to ever pay for my tunes, by the way, are Brian and a guy named Loot. So, uh, Jira, you're part of an exclusive club, bro. I really appreciate it. Oh, and shout out to Chili Boss, uh, who moved his Patreon uh, pledge from $1 to $2 an episode up to baller status. Thanks, bro. And uh, last but not least, shout out to DMA, the motherfucking bot master. So let's get started with a video sent to me by Spoke. Uh, it's presented by Pinguino, a recorded by Spoke. It's a very tech-related art presentation that includes uh, an ASCII printer, Spoke's backlit candle ASCII, and uh, even a wire beard. Uh, so let's take a look now. Hey, this is Pinguino. I'm here at Celcon, and this is a Hacker Village. Um, we spent a long time setting up an art gallery, so I'm going to show you some of the stuff we have in this list. I should be seeking right now. You came up in San Diego. So, this guy's using our ASCII printer, the burp from Fuelmade. And what it does is it takes a picture and your picture gets printed out as an ASCII on your seat paper. Um, there we have Grumpy Cat. Uh, we have Spoke Dancy, Votive Candle, down on a Luma panel. Behind it is an Luma panel cyborg that me and Necro made. Uh, a piece from Ninja Penguin that I forgot to bring to Ninja Penguin. Uh, um, this is a mask made of 3D, or sorry, of laser cut scraps from the ASCII printer build. We just took the scraps and made a mask out of it. Uh, and then back there, uh, Burp's um, ASCII printer can spread, split an image out to like four images. Um, so yeah. So that's the output of the ASCII printer. The ASCII printer can print out an image in a different strip, so you specify the, the amount of strips you want. So that's Servo, Kyle's dog, and we uh, made an image from that. And then um, this is a Yale Wire beard I made a long time ago for the DEF CON beard competition, uh, which won first place and looked like this. <laughs> and for a bit, we were doing 3D printing, so that's what this rig is. So yeah. Fucking yeah. Thank you so much, Pinguino and Spoke, uh, for sharing that with us. And congratulations to Spoke for getting her stuff on display and framed on such, uh, such short notice. So seeing all that great stuff makes me feel uh, really like a lazy piece of shit. Uh, because I don't do fucking anything except this and, I guess, go train jujitsu and go back and forth to work. So shout out to all you creatives that can put wires and shit together and you know hack stuff and all that and then present it uh i'm sure i could but again lazy fuck 
Um, yeah. So now onto the news. Here's a screenshot of Spoke watching somebody eat their own shit for one hundred dollars. Yes. Uh, I was even. God, that's disgusting. I didn't want to put the video up because it was too bad. Um, I will say that I think the money that the guy was given, it was like $120 or something was was uh, back charged or he didn't get the payoff. So it's fucking horrible. I wish the guy would IRC. Uh, anyway, there's that picture. Now this week, it had so many fuck ups. Uh, most of them from rats. But considering he fucks up every hour or so, I'm only going to include one of his per week, just in case he's, you know, faking it to try to get on the news. Um, I mean, he's the type of dude that IRCs from his phone while driving and playing Uno at the same time uh, on IRC. He's fucking mad. So let's take a look. You got Rat Salad with a 6, Sly with an AE slash 21, CE6 with a dot 2, Scrim with a win 39, and Carnivore with a slash cycle slash equals 2. Fucking hell, that's at least like two or three fuck ups in one. So there you go, guys, your fuck ups of the week. Um, this log was pasted on Sandnet, which has <clears throat> Regex word replacements. So sorry if it looks a bit odd. I can go ahead and read through it though. But just a little bit of context last week I reported that Incog linked a timestamp link of Load calling him a friend, but it looks like Incog bamboozled me. Or, as he put it, uh, he played with me a little bit. <laughs> Gross. You got me, bro. Uh, Incog actually linked a link of Looper and Hep talking about uh, flying him out just for sex. Incog, you're such a whore. Uh, but seriously, shout out to Incog for trolling us all, even though no one actually clicked the link. Uh, I've seen him chatting in IRC30 now a lot and over in Pound Stress. So uh, go get your fill if you miss him. Also, shout out to Patty from, from Pound Stress, who is very racist. Uh, but at least acknowledges it. Uh, yeah, so even uh, Jewbird quit recently and cited Incog as one of the reasons. Uh, well, I mean, he quit the LRH channel. Look, I love Incog, but I just wanted to point out that having a timestamp link of two internet girls talking about flying you out, just ready to produce to people, is sort of, I don't know, it's a bit weird. But hey, I'm a sad fuck, uh, so why am I judging, to be honest? All right, so... I pasted a log around uh, IRC that I thought had some funny shit in it. Look, I love Cutie and, and everything that she says, basically. And, and it's, it's really the only thing that I use Twitter for is to paste Cutie logs. So if you want to follow me on there, it's pp for l I was in early, bruh. Uh, anyway, Cutie said, uh, literally Googled random 19-year-old balding Angie Cleaner. So I had a nice little laugh at that, uh, but got to laugh even more when Dwayne responded by saying, that quote is odd, Angie has hair. <laughs> yes, she does, Dwayne. Yes, she does. Uh, the f anyway, I'm not even going to go in further to that, but I just thought it was funny that, that that's what he thought was odd about the quote. Uh, I mentioned uh, Jay Beasy, a.k.a. Jewbird, a.k.a. the long nose flyer leaving LRH. And his response to being asked if he would come back was, I will come back to LRH, but not today. I've had some developments in OS for my case, some good, some bad, and it put me in a shit mood. So it was probably mostly bad. Uh, and the mentioning of lifelong bans have reminded me of Incog's unjust lifelong ban. Thus, comparing me to Dark Mage and Incog, I had no choice but to leave. Now, I don't know, I wasn't around for that, but I don't, just don't see how he might catch a lifelong ban. Um, anyway, you'll be missed from LRH, bro, but I'm glad you're still on other channels like IRC30 and, and Pound Stress, sort of like Incog. Maybe you're like a small Incog, or we could call you Incog Bird. Uh, anyway, he is also still in Pound Fnet News, so if you like loads of spam and not much chat, head on over to that channel. So after Civil was gone for four days, or however long, uh, he came back and immediately slayed Xenic in Pound Fight Club, so check this out. You see him join, and then uh, Zenit quits. Now, I say immediately. It was like 30 minutes later, but I guess there was no chat in between there. Uh, anyway, what a pussy. Uh, call him a pussy over on the server uh, irc.gotham.chat in Pound Gotham. What a joker, huh? <laughs> Since many of you missed Dark Mage, including myself, uh, and actually this shirt has the word dark on it. Yeah, so that's because of Dark Mage. I wore it because they don't have Dark Mage shirts. Uh, anyway, 
many of you miss him. A lot of you don't keep up with what he's doing because he's either blocked you or you just kind of forgotten about him. Um, he put up a new song, and far be it from me to deprive you uh, of, of what just a wonderful song. And I think you'll hear from this song that not only has he improved, but he possibly might be the best rapper on FMAT if he would have stayed. So let's take a look. It's a short one. So uh, sorry that it's not longer, but let's take a listen. This is just the name of the game. Nothing gonna change. Stay in your lane. Yo, what's up? Guess what fucking time it is. Time to fuck you up with that black magic stuff. Yeah. You just a little, little bitch. I don't give a little shit. Throw you in a fucking ditch. Yeah. We making America great again, my friend. High energy as fuck. I don't give a shit what you think anymore. Language shapes the way we think. Time to get a drink. Get a glass of water from the fucking sink. That will quench my thirst. I'm the fucking worst. But that's alright, I'ma cut your fucking purse. Get my riches from the fucking bitches. Motherfucking haters, try to crush my wishes. Cleaning off my plate, it's time to do the dishes. Casting my spells like a sign, a glitch, bitch. Get my riches from the fucking bitches. Motherfucking haters, try to crush my wishes. Cleaning off my plate, it's time to do the dishes. Casting my spells like a sign, a glitch, bitch. Simply fucking amazing. Um, the bit about uh, drinking the sink water really resonated with me. Uh, man, keep it up, Dark Mage, man. You're doing great. Uh, regardless of if you come back to FNet or not, I just want to let you know that I do support you uh, and everything that you do, especially in music, because you really are uh, a shining star. Or actually, not shining, I would say a, a dark star or a, uh, a black hole, because I know that you're a dark type of dude. We have quite a few pick of Nicks this week, and I am so grateful to those that take part in this amazing segment that we seem to be doing quite regularly. Let's check out the first one sent in by Mella, this one of Nance or Nancy Drew, as she likes to go by. And then we got a Jason pick sent in by my man and fellow uh, jujitsu practitioner, Bista. Of course, I'm Jason, so <laughs> it's about me. <laughs> Uh, and finally, Panini sent in uh, by Chili Boss. So thank you guys so much for that content. It's definitely one of my favorite things to look for when I'm out. Oddly enough, I just see Sloth constantly because some shithead tags that name all around town. It's not even good. Uh, I think I used that about 10 episodes back, so maybe I can use it again because everyone would have forgotten. Uh, kind of like they've forgotten about Dark Mage. So, here's a couple quotes, one from Too High saying, Oh, and playgrounds in Japan are empty because women work now and the dudes fuck pillows. Uh, then a truly funny one from Dwayne, who said, Back in the day when spam mail was literally delivered to door, some loser company had a postage guaranteed thing. So I said, No problem, clean the cat box, packaged it up, affixed the sticker, and sent it to them. Woof. Don't know how God would feel about that, but I bet you one thing, Jesus does not like spam email. Let's take a look at some interesting spam in Pound LRH. Someone named Natalie Nine, or Nathalie, joined. Maybe it's Nathan and Natalie mixed together. Anyway, they said, hi, I'm Nathalie, and I'm 22 years old from Florida. I am selling 210 nude pictures for only $8. It took me over a year to make this, and you're really helping me out if you buy this. That means that I can pay my college a few days longer. So not only can they pay their college with two, with $8, but it took them a year to make 210 pictures of themselves. Um, very, very strange. But anyway, I, I left the link up there if you want to go follow along and uh, send them that eight bucks. Uh, and now a special edition of weather brought to you by SciMaster and Pacific Gas. Sci? Well, it looks like parts of Northern California are going to be without power, possibly for five days. At least that's what they're telling us to be prepared for. 
doesn't seem like it's a good plan because being without power for five days, a whole city, I see a lot of revenue for the city being lost because of this power outage. But if life gives you lemons, then you make lemonade. So your weatherman is going to be heading out of the city and heading up north. Welcome to ENN Weather, where we do the weather and other things. Today we're at the Jack Russell Brewery, and we're having some brewskis. And we're looking at some beer hops. Since we have no power at the home, we figured we'd go on a road trip. And that is what we did. Beer hop. What were the parents thinking? <laughs> While well, I'm home and the power is on. In the future, interlock switch, generator. That's the way to go. Five to B. I know you like the Dunsmere house. Shout out to Port 80 and back to you, Jason. Hell yeah, Simon. I appreciate that. And um, really nice to see the FNet News weather uh, a lot more visible today on the fucking bike. And I like where you put your watch. It's smart. Um, yeah, so the power outage hopefully didn't affect you too much, man. But it's nice that you got out and got to experience things. So. Uh, really weird decision by the, the power company there, but hey, that's what happens. All right, everybody, remember I'm I'm never on when all the fun stuff's happening. So private message me some links, or as Darren says, uh, give me a private whisper, uh, or email any leads or pictures to fnetnews at gmail.com. Of course, that includes Pick of Nick. Also, Racer and I are working on finishing our collaboration album. We probably have four or five more songs to go, but eventually there will be more pump music for that ass on Spotify and shit and all that. A shout out to the motherfucking patrons, which are literally the reason I keep doing this shit. Uh, Monkey, NK9K, Kong Fuzi, Black Angel, Zizzy, Subohm, Chrono, Misfit, Mela, Nance, Load, Sloth, Civil, Jira, Kaku, PCAP, Intradome, Psymaster, Lila, <laughs> Lila, Lily, she's correcting me on that, I'm so sorry. Estella, BB420, Deviance, Nevar, Scrim, Cosby X, Chex, Pokery, Echo Sean, Eraser, Monochrome, Jewbird, Meep Sheep, Smoke, Money Tree, Judge, Wheat and Kids, Stratum, Angie Peaches, DNSK, VXP, Carl, Demogorgo, Sif, Open Soul, Guess Right, Kakama, DMA, Chili Boss, Logic, and Monk. God damn, I'm a lucky motherfucker. Love you guys, man. We'll see you next week. Episode 139, I believe it will be. Uh, Jason Bandy, man. Peace. For more EFNet news, follow Vapor on Snapchat as Smiggy999 or on Twitter as PP4L. All around me are the worldwide losers. I see users. Fucking pieces of trash. Damn God.